Step 1. Scratch installation. Open your browser and type s4a.cat in the URL bar. This takes you to the Scratch for Arduino's official website. Now click Downloads and choose your preferred operating system for which the setup is to be downloaded. Save the file in your desired location. Once the download is done, unzip the zip file. Now, open the s4a.exe setup file and proceed with the installation. Step 2. Installing Arduino IDE Open your browser and type arduino.cc in the URL bar. This takes you to Arduino's official website. Click Software and then Downloads. Next, choose a setup file compatible with your operating system. Arduino is an open source platform. If you wish to contribute for their tremendous service, you can click contribute and download. If not, click just download. Save the file. Once the download is done, open the setup file. You can also download the software from the Microsoft Store or you can simply skip by pressing continue installing from outside the Microsoft Store. Complete the installation process. Step 3. Downloading firmware for scratch. In the S4A window, you might notice a searching board notification. For S4A software to detect and communicate with the Arduino, you need a special set of codes called firmware to be uploaded to the Arduino. To download the firmware, open the S4A official website. Click here to download the firmware. Save the file. Once the download is done, open the file. Click OK. Step 4. Uploading firmware to Arduino. In the Arduino window, click Tools, then go to Boards and select Arduino Uno. Again, click Tools, go to Port and choose the port. The port number varies from computer to computer, so your port number need not be the same as shown on the screen. Now, click Upload. 
This uploads the firmware to the Arduino. Step 5. LED Blinking using S4A Open the S4A software. Now, let's take a quick look on the various control tabs. Now, click Control and select the when green flag is clicked icon. Click, drag and place the icon in the center of the window. Next, click, drag and place forever and place it below the previously placed icon. Follow the entire process as shown on the screen and complete the code. Connect the LED's anode to pin number 13 and cathode to ground in the Arduino board. Once you click the green flag, the LED starts blinking. When the red button is clicked, blinking stops.